Hey everybody, it's Jordan with PDQ.com, and today we're going to answer the age-old question, can you use PDQ Deploy to deploy Smart Deploy's agent? There's a lot of deploys in there. And uh, the answer is yes. Uh, I have that confidence because you can see here I tested it first, uh, and that's what gives me confidence is, you know, measure, measure twice, cut, one, cut once. So we're going to go activities, add device, and we're going to generate the client installer. This will be unique to your environment when you go through and you get your licensing for Smart Deploy. Uh, this will give you everything you need. You just need to get it onto the machine. Uh, I'm choosing 64-bit because, you know, it's 2022 and 32-bit is no. Uh, normally, I'm supposed to put this in the repo, but uh, I'm going to put it on the desktop because I'm feeling froggy. I'm not following the rules, and we're mostly just showcasing that it does, in fact, work. And right there, yeah, there's our installer. And if we go back to the desktop, as we created successfully, what's that, Windows D for desktop? There we are. You can see here that it is an MSI file. That means all of the parameters are already known. There's no variation. These are defined by being MSI. All the silent parameters is, is good to go. So it's very easy with deploy. We're just going to come in here and we're going to uh, build a new package. And you're going to name it, uh, I don't know, smart deploy. If we're looking to get a little bit froggy with it. Did I have already said froggy? Have I gone too, uh, too much to the froggy well? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Install, and then we're just going to go to the desktop to where I put that uh, MSI file. And uh, that's it. All the assignment parameters are added. I'm just going to hit save here. And uh, now we have the package. We're going to test out a deployment. So we're going to deploy once. Use inventory. And, you know, I, I make fun of the 32-bit, but I do have a whole bunch of 32-bit in my lab. So I have to specify here 64-bit because I don't want to grab the wrong type. And we're going to do Ant-Man. Okay, and we're going to deploy that. I'm going to say it's going to take uh, 35 seconds. I'm going to entertain you with anti actics while we wait. I got nothing. I'm not an entertaining person. Uh, I guess while it's running, we can talk about, I guess, everything that goes into Smart Deploy. I guess everything that needs to connect automatically with your server is built into the MSI, all the information. You don't have to do anything customized. You probably can. Smart Deploy is pretty fantastic and robust. You don't have to. But you can. Success, 25 seconds. I was, I was uh, five seconds too long. I'm sorry for doubting our product. So if we come back to Smart Deploy now, we're going to go back to Computer Management and just wait for the new ones to check in. Nope, oh, look at that. That was there. was in there. And Ant-Man shows up. It's that quick. So if you are uh, off domain with that one, anything on your domain, Deploy is going to get it there instantly. If they're off domain, they're going to need to connect to the VPN or come in briefly. But then, as you saw, 25 seconds, they're gold. And now you have... Uh, the ability to image whenever you want. Uh, for PDQ.com, I'm Jordan.